Today's lesson is over function operations. You've done it before, you just haven't seen it in this format. What they'll do is they'll give you a list of functions, depending on what they are. This one, I've just got two functions. You may have three or four on your worksheet. You just look at the functions they're asking you to add or subtract or multiply or divide, and you do that with it. So, I've got f of x and g of x, and this says find f of x plus g of x. All you do is write each one down. I put them in parentheses like this, and then you add them, and you add like terms like you did at the very beginning. So this is x squared. You put 3x and 7x together. That gives you 10x, and then negative 4 and negative 5 are negative 9. It's truly that simple, okay? If I'm asked to divide, not divide, if I'm asked to subtract functions, bear in mind, just like you did at the beginning of the year, we want to write our functions down. We're, we're doing f of x minus g of x. Whichever one they ask you to put first, that's the one you put first. They might say g of x minus f of x, so be careful about that. If they say g of x minus f of x, you would put g of x first. Put the one you're subtracting in parentheses. Remember to change the signs. You want to make this negative n and this positive 6, and then put them together, put like terms together like you used to. And in this particular problem, the n's cancel out, but that's all you do. You add like terms. After you change the sign, that's going to be where you make your error if you make one. Okay, then sometimes they tell you to multiply. Now, some of this you did at the beginning of the year, you just didn't see it in this format. So, here's f of x and here's g of x, and we are multiplying f of x times g of x. Remember what you do. Now, uh, you're doing this, and my notes have it where I used to teach it a different way, but just remember, you're taking the first one, multiplying it by both of those. That's what this is. Taking the second one and multiplying it by both of these, and that's what you get here. Then after you do all that, you add your like terms. x squared times 3x, 3x cubed. x squared times negative 3, negative 3x squared. x times 3x, 3x squared. x times negative 3, negative 3x. And then you put your like terms together. These cancel. Now, this and this are not like, be very, very careful. This is x to the third, and this is x. So, they cannot be put together. All right, division. I'm finding h of x divided by g of x. So, literally, you just put this one on top of this one. If, by chance, this factor, you would take it down further and, and do more, but this does not factor. So, you just write it like that. Thank you.